Okay, so we, we got a new mode now. Uh, it is called the Infernal Spire. Spiral? Spiral? Infernal Spiral? There we go. Um, apparently it's like a complete Slay the Spire-esque mode. So we don't build the deck or anything. We're going to build the deck as we go through the dungeon. And it looked like a very, very large dungeon. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and go with... Let's go with the mage. This knowledge must not be lost. And we're gonna go through this now. Oh, we'll keep, we'll keep that. That's a good hand to start off with. And then we get a level one trait. Um, any abilities which cost a specific suit, we will take that. E yes. That makes everything so much easier in the deck. Now, here's the map. So, uh. We're gonna we're gonna try to get through as much as we can. Uh, if you're watching this on YouTube, this is probably gonna be broken into a couple sections because this is you know normally we go about this far or so and it's about an hour. So yeah, this is it's a big spiral. It's crazy. It's crazy. So we're gonna start this off. Um, we we already got our gift of Cardrasil, so we go. Counter? Oh no, we go gift first. Okay. Seed of Death. Is treasure. Uh, to con oh, these are all consumables. Deal 10 damage to an enemy. Negates target's traits until the next turn. Cannot be resisted. Astounding. Seed of Life. When you are about to be defeated, heal 10 HP. So basically like extra life. That's pretty cool. Deal 5 damage to all enemies and negate all enemy traits. Cannot be resisted. Yeah, let's take that. That seems pretty good. Um, and then we go to our first encounter. Now our deck's gonna be basic. Can we look at it? We can. We can look at our 10 cards in our deck. Not a whole lot here, right? And then as we go, we're gonna get random cards. Us, this is us assuming, right? We're gonna get random cards to build our deck with. So this ought to be really, really interesting. Oh, Arcane Volley, that's a good one. And we can go ahead and fire. <clears throat> All right, so now we have three choices. We got heal, add an ability, or heal. We'd like to add an ability, right? We'd, we'd really like that. Um, that would lead us to either an upgrade or add another ability. We got reduce, we got remove cards. We got event cards, we got elite group encounters. Merchant's way, way over here. I think middle is going to be our best bet. Okay, until we get to like... Here, then we'll probably come down and either hit a level. An early level. Or we'll hit to the merchant, I think. So we'll add an ability. I think merchant isn't good for mage. We just have to make sure we have enough cards to get in there. Um, it's not so much the, the one to offense or the one to defense cards. Uh, it's the utility one, right? Whether it's like a draw or if it's a negate damage, all those things can really help. Uh, a red jack or better fire one deal four damage to an enemy. Yeah, we'll go ahead and take that. We're like card tricks really aren't going to help us because we've already got like, we've already My got chromatic bond. Is ancient. So like card trick doesn't really help us. I guess what we'll do is we'll go ahead and hit him with Jim Jacks. And then we'll hit him with an ice bolt. And really I should be unearthing too, but let's go ahead and get another ability. Fireballs. Let's go. That's huge. It is such a good card to grab early. I will the menagerie of elements. Now we just gotta get a... Uh, what do we need? We need one more red card? <laughs> a simple cantrip. Yeet! Maybe it won't take us that long to get through this. Upgrade an ability in your deck. I'm curious to see what this is. I'm guessing we can take... Uh, I was going to say, it's going to turn it from 
white to silver, silver to gold. So what did we just... We traded out a fire for a fire too. I'm okay with that. Yeah, that's fine. The the other the better one would have been maybe the card trick, because that would upgrade it to where I think it wild cards more than one card. Hi, Denise. Hello, how are you? Prepare yourself. All right, so we got Capra. Overdraw an ability and draw a card. So let's do that. We should be doing that every turn. All right. Let's see if we can get this guy tapped. Mm, two, four, five. Let's see if we tap him first. Nope. So we'll just get him as uh, do as much damage as we can to him, and we can attack him with a queen, maybe. No, no. Guess we can't. That's fine. We we take a damage. Ooh, we're gonna take some damage here too. All right, get rid of my get rid of some cards there. Pair of tens. Well, luckily we drew a Joker, so we can tie him on that one. I have seen your end. Mm, unearth me. Gain one shield, draw a card. Sure. I make my own refuge. He's only got one HP. Let's just hit him with the ace. Oh, you piece. All right. Well, I didn't want to use another ability. I was trying to save up some. Didn't happen. All right, let's hit another ability up. What do we get? Singularity. All enemies suffer damage equal to their defense. Untamed Barrier. This is a good way for us to use some cards we don't normally use either, which is really kind of cool. Top deck a red card to gain a shield. Top deck again, if successful, to gain a shield. Okay, yeah, sure. Sure. I think we're gonna take the elite encounter so we can get the level up. I think that's what I wanna do. Oh, look at this. Add a buff to your deck? Add armor to your deck? Yeah, we're probably gonna skip the merchant. So let's hit up the group encounter. I will the yeah, barrier seemed real nice. Let's see how nice it is. That hand will not work. Oh, I don't even have to play anything. I can just. It didn't cost anything. That's really good. It's just free. It's just always going to be, well, it's not always going to be, but it's free. I am tempted. All right, let's draw, draw an ability, draw a card. Let's, let's hit him with some eights. We'll kill one, or try to kill one. And then we're gonna go ahead and conjure Cloak. I make my own refuge. And let's go to Mana Main too. This is one of those situations where I think it's better for us to kind of... I was hoping to clear the board. But... I make my own refuge. If we can get to where we're not going to take as much damage, it's probably good. I, everything's tapped now, so we're not going to take any hits. Yeah, we'll go ahead and ice bolt. In turn, the stars are in alignment. An untamed barrier again? I guess a wild card doesn't count as a red card. Good, good to know. Let's save the fireball. We'll ice, ice bolt, and we'll do an attack with an ace. Cause I gotta remember, I gotta get back in the, the mage mindset. Like face cards, hairs, that stuff doesn't 
really matter too much. It's mostly just I need a good mix of red and black cards. Do it! I'm doing it! I'm doing it! Alright, let's get our level up. Ah, uh, yes. Redraw now cards I'm you gonna... use on a standard attack. Or plus one ability damage. Or plus one defense, two max health. One defense per heart in your hand. Your hearts deal two def defense damage. Um. Yeah, but it's only on a standard attack. Redraw all but one card you use on an ability. Yeah, no, this is what we want. That's what I forgot. I forgot he gets on an abilities too. That's yeah. That's just good. That's just yeah. I forgot how good it is. All right, let's uh, hit him with some tins. Okay. And then let's do an overdraw, our unearth. Uh, we can go ahead and fireballs. <laughs> would you have been really, would, how upset would you have been, Ruff, if I didn't grab it? Alright, he's got a safe attack, so we're not, it doesn't matter, we're not going to be able to beat him. we we'll just do one of those. Hit him with an ace. We're good to go. All right. Um, what do we? What do you say we do an event? So we can do an event. That will just lead us over here. Where what? We get another ability. We get two more abilities if we go this way, or we get an ability, another group elite group encounter, and then we can get an armor. I mean, I'm getting used to people not listening. I was listening! Very in Select one of the following cards. Deny offering or one attack damage if there are multiple enemies. Minus one if there's only one. Mmm. Mmm. I don't like either one of these. I, I don't like either one of those. Because on one hand, it works really well with like our fireball and everything, the health work. But like on the other hand, it's like. It, it, a lot of times there's only one enemy left after like we kill a bunch of them, you know? All right, we got lion's mane or we got golden pyramid. We also have Conjured Cloak that we could choose from as well. I wish I could look at my entire deck. Um, I can click view map, but I can't click on the deck to actually see what's in my deck. And I kind of wish I could. Let's go ahead and take the lion's mane. I wield the menagerie. A dungeon lobster? I don't think I've ever seen a dungeon lobster before. Or a shamphibian. You're gonna have a huge deck soon? I mean, we're still only up to 14 cards. That's... That's 100% manageable. And honestly, if we get a chance, we want to remove some of these. We want to get rid of these card tricks. Um, so... We have some fat we can trim, that's for, that's for sure. Just go ahead and fireball. Dungeon Lobster is my ex's new nickname. Oh my god. Oh my god. Lion's Mane plus one. Gain two shield, draw two cards. This is a good card. Because we're gonna get the we're gonna get one of the cards back from casting it, and then we're gonna get a two additional. So this is a, this this card is now a net gain for us. Basically what this card says is draw or gain two shields, draw a card, and it costs us nothing. So. No, the Conjured Cloak. It, it constantly gives us more cards. So like we can play an ability 
we can play like our first ability that costs more than one we're, we'll get half of that card like say it costs two say we play lion's mane we're only gonna get one card back from that then we play conjured cloak and we're back up to five cards it's kind of cool um lion's mane's good too though but we like we have a lot of already have a lot of damage being able to get back where i could cast like another spell or say like i'm off i don't have four three reds i only have like two i can play the black cards get red cards from it my power is ancient i gotta remember does flying in standard combat so it doesn't matter about so like here's a perfect example like we drew it right so like imagine this fire is a fireball right i don't have three red cards but what I can do is I can Lion's Mane, right? That could have been a red, wasn't. Into a Conjured Cloak. Now I've got all black cards. Doesn't make any sense, but it happens. Still have all black cards. Doesn't make any sense, but it happens. This is, this is ridiculous. This is, let's make you red real quick. Oasis. There we go. That's a pretty decent turn. We got three shield and we did what? Nine damage to him? Pretty good. And I'm going to go ahead and see the destruction. I don't want to I don't want to play around with that guy. So we can get equipment. We can get a buff. Add a buff to your deck. Oh. A buff could be good. Especially because buffs don't fall off. Unless like they explicitly say they do. So like we could get to the buff. That would be that would be pretty good. Let's get a buff. Let's get a buff. What do we got? Forbidden knowledge. That's good. Cyclone, plus one offense, gain additional attack when you successfully attack, draw an ability to replace. Eh. Mage armor, plus one defense, suffer for one, minus one ability damage. Let's take the forbidden knowledge. I'm, I'm okay with that. Let's get our level up. Locus of Magi. Yes. Yes, we'll, we'll take that. Yes, we will. Um, all right, now now we branch off again. So Blake lied, thought he could only play one day. I don't know. You'll have to take that up with Blake Val. <laughs> Got a rest over here we're probably going to need. So let's go. Do we do the elite or do we go to the event? The event just lost us last time. It was not good. Or, 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 or. Or. Group encounter, remove an ability from the deck. Overdraw to the elite encounter to the merchant. Let's do that. Let's do that. That'll be... That's an interesting play. So there's our there's our forbidden knowledge. We'll take that. Now, this is bad. In, like, a real bad way. We didn't draw... anything that we needed to. So we're going to be in a lot of trouble here. And I mean, like, a lot. So he got a pair of nines. We've only got a pair of eights. That's bad. We might we might lose right here, actually. It's very likely we're about to lose. Especially because these guys have scavenger. Uh, oh, it's when an ally is defeated. We just have to survive this one round. Okay, there we go. Okay. All right, so we can unearth or, 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 let's just card trick the seven. A simple cantrip. 
We'll hit him with the flush real quick. That is not a valid attack. What did I mess up there? Oh, that's a club. Okay, well, um... Yeah, so, uh, anyways... Like I was saying... We'll, uh, attack that scavenger with a pair of nines. Then we can fire this guy. And he's gonna suffer one and at the start of his turn and so he'll be gone go ahead and unearth another volley that's cool save it all right so let's remove ability from our deck we're gonna go ahead and remove the card trick thin our deck out a little bit the the less cards we have the better we want just a bunch of good cards we don't want a bunch of crap having a couple utility is good but having too much utility basically is going to bog you down to the point where you're just drawing utility and you're not doing any damage. We're going for like a real bursty damage type build. Uh, da, 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 da. All right, let's go ahead. Boom, boom. And then we'll go ahead and hit this guy. Hit a pair of jacks on you. An overdraw. Conjured cloak. We'll say it's a good turn. We'll say it's a good turn. Okay. Now we get another ability. Now we can skip. We can skip. Time warp. Overdraw three cards from the top of your discard pile. Prophecy. Deal three damage to all enemies when target is defeated. Yes, yes, yes. We'll take that. We will take that. I, will the menagerie I didn't want to draw it immediately. Thanks, game. Pre appreciate you. Okay, so we got a lion's mane. Let's hit him with a pair of fours. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah. That is kind of lame. That's it. That's it. We died. <sighs> okay. Oh, and we still get all the other good stuff too. So we still get to unlock more cards. Okay. I'm not, I'm not too mad. I'm not, I'm not mad. Did they add some new cards with this update as well? Deal two attack damage twice, draw an ability. It's got two attacks. It's cost two attacks. Okay. 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 All right. Well, we'll try again. 